Hi guys and welcome back to another Gym Possible Workout. So today I'm going to be doing a dumbbell workout with you. So you need two dumbbells or your equivalent. So whether this is your tins of beans or two big bottles of water, then you just need them for this workout. And always guys, I do recommend that you have a bottle of water ready to go and keep yourself nice and hydrated as we go along as well. Um, so today we've got six exercises for you today, all different weight upper body exercises, and we'll go through them each one at a time doing 10 reps before moving on to the next one, and then we'll have 30 seconds rest um, before continuing on to the next exercise. So I hope that's nice and clear, but before we start guys, it's always really important to warm your body up, get those muscles working um, so that we don't injure them. So it's good to start with a five minute warm up just to keep nice and warm. So when we're ready, I'm just going to start our timer and off we go. We're just going to start off with our arms in and out. So you're just going to bring them in and out, getting them working, really waking those muscles up for the day. Really good. Try and keep your balance as well as you do it. So you're working that core and trying to get those core muscles a little bit engaged as well to start off with. Really good. We're going to go for about a minute on this one. Keep going. Try and keep those elbows nice and high as well and level with your shoulders. Right, then left. Right, then left. Yeah, really good. Keep going, guys. Nice and strong. You've got about 20 seconds left, so if you wanted to speed it up even faster, you can do. Just make sure you don't lose your balance like I am. Yeah, really good. Well done, guys. Get those arms going. Five, four, three, two, one, and off we go. So we're just going to reach up and down, up and down. Get a nice good stretch for those arms. Really reach up. Well done. Nice and strong. If you're struggling to balance with this, you can do it one arm at a time. That might give you more balance and actually might give you more range as well, which is not a problem. Just do what might suit you. Quite like it one arm at a time. I might stick with it. Really good. So we're just waking those mus our muscles up in our arms and our upper body to make sure they're nice and warmed up. Really good. And we're just going to do five more. So one, two, three, four. Five, and relax those arms. Well done, guys. Shake them out. Make sure you're nice and loose. And as usual, we're just going to go on to our dynamic stretch, which is going to be our long mode. So all you're going to do is a short pull with your elbow nice and high, and then a long pull following your arm all the way through. We're going to do 10 on each arm. So when you're ready, off you go. One. That's it. Two. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, got a nice clicky arm today. Nine, and one more on this arm. Ten, really good. And switch over. We're going to do ten on the other arm as well. Off we go. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more on this arm. Ten. Really good job, guys. Well done. Shake out those arms again. Make sure you're nice and loose. And as usual, we're just going to finish off our warm up with our neck stretches. So really relax those shoulders, sit nice and tall, and you're just going to look from left to right, nice and slowly, and you really stretch that neck ground. So two, three. We're going to do this ten times, guys. Four, five, six. Eight, nine, and 
one more. Ten. Really good, guys. Well done. Shake it all out. Make sure you're nice and loose. Grab a quick drink. And that is your full five minute warm up complete. So well done. Guys, I just forgot to mention at the beginning of the video, make sure you look out for that code word. It is going to be implanted somewhere in this video, so keep an eye out for it. And you'll need to remember it so you can submit it to your gym possible to prove that you've watched its workout and you've taken part in it. So don't forget to submit that code word when it pops up. Really good job. But well done, guys. We're just going to go on to our first exercise now. Get those arms really working. And our first exercise is other classic bicep curls. So we're gonna do one arm at a time for this. So all you're gonna do is have your elbow into your body. Try not having your elbow resting on your wheel or your thigh. Try and lift up a bit and so your arm is taking the full weight of the weight itself. Then you're just gonna bend at the forearm, bringing your, arm, your, what is it, your palm up to your chest, sorry, and then back down. So you're gonna bring it up and back down, extending that arm again. We're gonna do 10 on each arm, nice and slowly when you're ready. Off you go guys. One, two, three, remember to sit nice and tall as well. Four, really relax those shoulders. Five, six, seven, eight, nine and one more on this arm ten really good and switching straight over and we're going to go the same thing on the left arm one two three four five really feel that bicep working six seven Eight, nine, and one more on this arm. Ten, really good job, guys. Well done. I'm gonna give you about 30 seconds rest, then we'll get going and get on to exercise number two. And uh, exercise number two, we're just gonna do the shoulder press. So you're gonna have your arms at a 90 degree angle, so your elbows are level with your shoulders. You're just gonna press up to the side and then come back down to that 90 degree angle. If you struggle with balance, though, just like me, you can do this one arm at a time. So we'll do 10, 10 on one arm and then 10 on the other arm. And so I'm just gonna go my right arm first. So make sure that elbow's level and you go up and down. So that's one, two, three, four. Really reach up as far as you can with that weight. Five, six. Seven, eight, nine, and one more on this right arm. 10, really good. And switching straight over and doing the same with your left arm. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and one more on this arm. Ten, really good job guys, well done. Have a nice break, you've got 30 seconds rest again, and then we'll get on to exercise number three. Exercise number three is gonna be the lateral raises. So you, all you're gonna do is have your arms by your side, and simply gonna raise them up in a straight line so they're level with your shoulders and back down again. So please make sure you've got enough room space around you, enough room, we've measured it so I've got exact millimetres away from the weight. So when you're ready, we're gonna do 10 and off we go. One, two, nice and controlled, you don't wanna go too fast guys. Three, four, five, Seven, eight, nine, and one more. Ten. Really good job. Well done. Rest those arms again. Got another 30 seconds rest. 
And then we'll go on to exercise number four. Exercise number four is gonna be what we call hammer curls. Now hammer curls are very similar to the bicep curls. They do work the biceps still. But they also work more of your chest and your back muscles as well. So it's the same thing. Instead of having your um, palms facing up, you're just gonna face your palms in and you're gonna do the same action. So you're gonna bring your forearms up and back down again. And we can do this double handed. This one. So off we go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. It takes concentration for me to balance. Six. Seven. Keep it going, guys. Eight. Nine. And one more. Ten. Really good. Well done. Have a nice rest there again, guys. Grab a quick drink. And we're going to get ready to go on to our rows. So for this one, all you're going to do is lean forward on one arm. You're going to have the weight hanging down as low as you can. And you're just going to pull the weight to your chest and back down. Bringing that elbow nice and high as you do it. We're going to do 10 on each arm. So when you're ready, off you go. One. Two, three, four, five, that's it, really reach down, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more on this arm, ten. Really good, sit back up, change over, and the same on the other arm. Off we go, one, two, go as far forward as you want guys, go to where you can balance, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and one more ten really good job guys well done relax those arms you've got 30 seconds rest again before we go on to exercise number six exercise number six we're just going to do shoulder shrugs so you're going to have your weight by your sides hanging down and you're just going to shrug those shoulders up and back down up and back down nice and controlled and we're gonna do 10 of these as well. So when you're ready, off you go guys. One, two, three. Oh, my shoulders are clicking. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more, 10. Really good job, guys, well done. Pop those weights on your lap, give those arms a nice rest. That is one set complete. We've done all six exercises for one set, um, and we're gonna repeat that two more times. We're gonna do three sets in total. So have a quick break, and then we'll start back with the bicep curls again, and we'll do one arm at a time for the bicep curls. Grab a quick drink though, guys. Really good, well done. Make sure you really do give those arms a rest by popping the weights down, either on your lap or on the floor. Just make sure you take that weight off your arms to give them a nice good break. But we're gonna start off with the bicep curl again. Remember, we're gonna do 10 on each arm, nice and controlled, and really try not to rest your arm on the wheel. Really good. So get those arms ready. And um, we're going to go for 10. Off you go, guys. Well done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine and one more ten really good and switch over we're going to do the same on the other arm one 
Good job guys, well done. Relax those arms again, give them a nice break. And then we'll get ready to go on to exercise number two, which is our shoulder presses again. Remember you can do these double handed, where you have your arms at a 90 degree angle, press up and down, or you can do them single handed. I'm gonna go with single handed again. So when you're ready, we're gonna do the right arm first. Remember we're doing 10 on each arm. So when you're ready, off you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, oh, this feels strong now, nine, and one more, ten, really good, well done guys, switch over, same with the other arm, one, two, three, don't let that elbow drop below that shoulder, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more this time, and really good job, well done guys, and relax those arms again, you've earned a nice break again before we go on to our lateral raises, which is will be our third exercise. We're powering on through this second set, well done. Hopefully your arms are not feeling too tired. Um, remember your lateral raises, you have your weights by your side. You're gonna raise them up so they're in a straight line with your shoulders and come back down. Don't bring your arms higher than your shoulders, keep them nice and level. And we're gonna do 10. Let's get your arms ready. And off you go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more. Ten. Really good job, guys. Well done. Relax those arms again. Really good job. I really felt like my arms all over. They are killer, those ones. They look easy, but they don't let them fool you. So we're going on to our hammer curls next. Same kind of uh, form as the bicep curls, just with our palms facing inwards. Remember, we're just going to bend at the forearm, come up and down. And we're going to do this with both hands. Let's get those arms ready. Ten. Off we go. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more. And really good job, guys. Well done. Relax those arms again before we go on to exercise number five. So for our fifth one, remember guys, we're going on to our rows where we lean forward and you're just gonna pull that weight to your chest and back down again. Try and get as much range of movement as possible. So you really wanna drop that weight right down. And we're gonna go one arm at a time, so 10 on each arm. When you're ready guys, off you go. One, two, Try and keep looking ahead of you if you can when you're doing this one. So it keeps your neck up. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And one more in this arm. Ten. Really good, well done. And switch over, same thing on the other arm. And off we go, one, two, three, 
four, five, six. Keep looking up if you can. Seven. I have to remind myself. Eight. Nine. And one more on this arm. Ten. Really good job. Well done, guys. Right, have a nice break quickly. We've got one uh, exercise left before we can have another drink. So grab both of your weights again and we're going to do our shoulder shrugs. So you can have your weights by your side. Right, we're going to shrug those shoulders to those ears and then back down nice and slowly. We're going to do 10 together with both arms. Make sure you really control that weight though. Don't drop it anywhere. So 10, off we go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more. Really shrug. Ten. Well done. And relaxing. Well done. That is your second set complete, so really well done. Hope you're feeling nice and warm and those muscles are really working nice and hard. We've got one more set to go, so if you are really ready to power on through and do another set, then please do and enjoy it with me. But grab a quick drink first. And we'll get ready to start off with our bicep curls again. Um, remember, we're still doing 10 on each arm. It's really important that you continue to really control those weights and as you bring them down and really engaging those muscles as much as you can. You don't want to do it too fast because the muscles won't engage and work as hard as they should be. So we're going to start off with exercise number one again. Remember we're doing six exercises for the last set. Let's get those arms ready. It's going to be a tough one but power on through you can do it. So on the right arm we're going to do ten exercises. Off you go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more on your thumb. Ten. Really good. And switch over. You're going to do ten on the left arm too. One. Two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, and one more. Ten. Really good job. Well done, guys. That's the first exercise complete. You've got about 30 seconds rest. And then we'll go on to exercise number two. Exercise number two, remember, we're going to go into the shoulder press. And you can either do it one-handed or two-handed again, remember. I'm going to do it one-handed. So remember, that 90-degree angle, press up to the sky and then come back down for that 90-degree angle. Don't let your elbow drop. Always keep it level with your shoulder if you can. It's a way better technique. So 10 on each arm. When you're ready, off you go. One. Two, three, and one more on this arm. Ten. Really good. And then switch over. Ten on the other arm as well. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more. This one was ten. Really good job, guys. Well done. I'll give you about thirty seconds rest again. So grab another drink if you need to. And then we'll go on to our lateral raises. So remember, these are the ones where we have 
our arms by our side and we're just going to raise them up so they're in a straight line and back down again nice and controlled don't flap your wings too fast on this one you want to really engage those muscles okay one two three four five six seven eight oh don't lose the balance nine and one more ten really good job guys well done relax those arms again pop those weights on their lap just give your nice arms a nice rest and then we'll go into exercise number four which is going to be our hammer curls so remember we're just going to turn that grip from the bicep in and you're, once again if you cannot rest your elbows on your wheels on your knee and if you need to for balance that's fine and we're just going to go up and down again nice and controlled we're going to do 10 of these so when you're ready off you go one two three four five six try and sit nice and tall as you do these seven Eight, nine, and one more. Ten. Really good job, guys. Well done. Pop those weights on those lats again. I know your arms will be getting tired by now, but please power on through. We've got two more exercises going up it, and we're going to go on to our row next. So remember, we're just going to lean on one arm, have the weights down below us, and pull up to our chest. So when you're ready guys, and nice and slowly, one, two, three, four, Ooh, try not to hit your brake, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, really good and change over same with the other arm lean forward as far as you can one two three four five six seven eight nine and one more and really good job guys, well done. Relax those arms again. One more exercise to go. I promise we're really, really new there. And we're just gonna finish with our shoulder shrugs. So you need both your weights again. And you're just gonna have your weights by your side. Shrug those shoulders up and down again. Nice control, we're gonna use 10 with both arms together. So get those arms ready. We're gonna go in three, two, one, and off you go. One, two, three. Really shrug those shoulders, so there's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more. 10 really good job guys well done and i've got good news you can pop those weights down now we are finished with them really really good work Whew. you might need to shake those arms out get them nice and loose but really good hope you're feeling like those arms and working nice and hard now that's not easy to do three sets so if you manage to do all three six sets of me well done you should be really really proud um grab a quick drink and then guys before we finish we're just going to do a quick cool down Make sure we've stretched our muscles out so we're not sore tomorrow and help us prevent some injuries as well. Really strong effort, guys. Well done. Just be really, really proud. Oh, my arms do feel a bit like jelly now, but hopefully that means I've worked them nice and hard. 
So we're just going to start off our cool down with some arm rolls. We're going to do 10 on each arm backwards, nice and slowly. So when you're ready, just follow me. We're going to go one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more on this arm. Ten, really good. And switch over. Ten on the other arm. Nice and slowly. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more. Really nice, good roll. Ten, well done. Shake out those arms again, make sure you're nice and loose. And we're just going to finish off with a few static stretches. So you're going to have your arms straight. Cross it across your body for me. Just support it with the other hand, pulling it towards you. And we're gonna hold this for 10 seconds. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and relax again. Well done. Switch over, same with the other arm. Cross it across your body. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Really good. And relax it again. Well done. We're then just going to stretch our triceps because our triceps have also worked very hard. And you're going to reach up, drop your arm down behind your back. And if you're able to, you're going to put it across with the other hand and hold it there. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight, nine, ten, and stretch out around. And the same with the other arm. Stretch up, drop it down, and put it across. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And really good job and stretch out and round again. Well done, guys. Just a couple more. I really promise we're nearly there. It's a really good stretch out though. So we're just going to stretch up into the air as far as you can go. Hold it there. One, two, three, Ooh, four. Feels good. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And stretch out and round. Well done. And we're just going to finish off by doing our neck stretches as well. Make sure our neck's nice and loose as well. So we're just going to tilt our head to one side and hold it there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And switch over to the other side. Same thing. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Really good job. Well done, guys. And shake it all out. Get nice and loose. If there's any other stretches you want to do, then please do go ahead and do them. I can't advocate stretching enough. It's so, so important. So really make sure your body's nice and stretched out, especially after quite a tough session like that. So well done. Really, really good work. I hope you enjoyed the new weight exercises that we are doing and well done for tuning in. And if you've managed to make it all the way through, well done, looking really strong. So well done, you should be really proud. We'll see you, soon, soon. We'll see you again soon for another Gym Possible workout. Have fun, see you soon.